new storm team. 546 here on your Wednesday morning. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. Uh, Harvey's icy. looking, yeah. It's icy. Oof, yeah. Let me tell you, there was a video, not a smart idea, but there was a video online yesterday of somebody ice skating. There was a bunch of videos. Everyone that had ice skates, I think, got out on the ice at some point yesterday. We could, we could have played hockey out in the parking lot here. I mean, yeah. it, it, it was not good, and it still isn't good. So no. uh, if you have to get out today, obviously you got to be careful once again. Yeah. They haven't improved in LA. Right. Almost the same. Now the main roads are better, so that's mm -hmm. that's a good thing. If you're someone that can stay on the main roads, stay on them. But obviously these side roads, back roads aren't any it, aren't good. It is just, you know, when you think about it, it is just amazing how much that little bit of drizzle. I mean, it didn't seem like a lot because it was just a small amount yeah. of time, but boy, uh, just the right amount of ingredients with that. What, what did you say? The convective arrow? Was that was that was flowing through, through I, yesterday? I mean, that's what it was. But yeah. yes, I pay attention when he when he talks sometimes. But I, say, I don't know if I said that, but <laughs> one of the KX Storm team members did. We, we long day for us, but luckily, uh, I think all the KX Storm team uh, got home safely last night. So that's good. Yeah, and then like and even now, Watford City on the other hand, they look fine. Yeah, and they are fine. fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But we'll, let's we'll stay here. Yes, yeah. we'll, we'll start this off on our satellite and radar. We're seeing clear skies up to the north and to the west. You got some light snow to the southeast, maybe some light freezing rain, but it's finally uh, moving out. That precipitation will leave us uh, the day and we won't see some for all the way up until probably Sunday. There's a light chance, but even that looks to be pretty small. Uh, your road conditions map right now is showing us uh, no travel advised down into the south central, maybe trying to reach into the southeast. You're still seeing that layer of ice and it's going to last today. Now there is a chance uh, that that sun starts to shine and that could help uh, with some relief, but it's not going to be total relief. You're still going to be looking at ice most likely into the next few days uh, up until probably Saturday. Friday will be the biggest day. Temperatures in the 40s. You also have sunny skies. Temperatures right now though are sitting mostly in the single digits. We got some teens. We got some 20s. We also see some 30s. Bismarck at 31. Linton at 30 right now. Some cloud cover down to the south has helped you keep a little bit warmer than areas up to the north and up to the west. Where we're starting to see the clear skies. We'll continue to cool off the rest of the morning, but as we get into the afternoon, that's where we'll start to warm up, especially out there to the southwest. Wind speeds and directions 5 to let's go 15 miles per hour, mostly from the north. These winds do stay like this today. It's one of the positives, I think, right now is winds aren't gonna, really going to pick up. They're going to stay calm all the way through the end of the week, end of this weekend. May see some wind gusts Sunday, but even that looks to be a pretty small chance. And your absolute comfort plumbing and heating wind chill report has single digits, lower teens up to the north, below zero out there to the far west. West of Wolf Point, and then we have these areas in the 20s. Uh, so still going to need to bundle up. Obviously, if you're someone that has to drive, uh, bring a blanket, bring that coat just in case you do get stuck and have to sit in your car for a little bit. It is uh, pretty cold out there. Don't want to get that frostbite in these conditions. Uh, highs this afternoon, uh, mid to lower 30s, uh, up to the north into the south central. Now these areas down to the south central, you're going to need to be a little bit warmer for more ice relief. We'll have to see if the sun gets out a little bit more today than expected. Don't be surprised if you see mid 30s in areas like Bismarck or flasher. We get out to the west, upper 30s, mid to lower 40s down to the southwest. Uh, you didn't get much precipitation, so get to enjoy those 30s and 40s as we get through the afternoon. Precision cast, not much to see. Again, we're staying dry uh, through the rest of the day today into tomorrow. Lots of sunshine there, and then Friday has lots of sunshine as well. Now, once we get into Saturday, we're going to see a, a north wind or winds from the north. That's going to pull in some cold Canadian air into the region, but many of us are looking to stay relatively sunny, just some light cloud cover building there and your highs for tomorrow are back in the mid to upper 30s here in the central portion those 40s out there to the west your williston five-day forecast has got us in the 30s the next two days 40s on friday 30s and 20s back for your weekend dickinson 40s for the next three days 30s on saturday and on sunday your minot seven-day forecast that's got us in the 30s today into tomorrow 40s for your friday 30s and 20s for the weekend then 30s as we get into new year's day and that second day of 2024 your business Mark seven day forecast 30s and 40s the rest of the week 30s and 20s for the weekend 30s on Monday and Tuesday and I do want to thank one of our the, one of the uh, significant others of our KX crew yesterday who got me out of trouble just driving out of our parking lot just sliding like this came out with some cat litter there you go traction people I yeah. mean it sounds kind of strange like cat litter in your back of your car but it really does make a difference for traction because if it's just yeah. ice you're you're big trouble. Yeah, you, you're definitely going to be just yeah, again, be prepared. The roads have mm -hmm. not gotten any better, yeah. especially those side roads. So again, if you have to leave today, please stay safe. That's right. Stone, thanks very much. Coming up here on Good Day Dakota, one German town